like most advanced economies, employers in Spain are currently struggling to find people to fill job vacancies. A survey recently done by Manpower Recruitment showed that one in every four vacancies in Spain have not been filled. In this short video, I'm going to explain to you three ways that you can move to Spain. Here are some reasons why you should consider watching this video. You do not need English language proficiency test to move to Spain. The total cost of applying for Spanish work permit is only 154 euros. One of the options that you can use to move to Spain is a fully paid conference where you'll be given support to apply for visa. And if you have entrepreneurship idea, you will be able to network with investors. You will be able to take your family with you if you get Spanish work permit. The supporting spouse will have an open work permit. Your children will be able to access services such as health education free of charge. Because Spain is at the heart of Europe, you will therefore be able to travel to the 27 countries that make up the EU, such as France, Germany, Belgium, and the Netherlands. After just five years of living and working in Spain, you will be able to apply for Spanish residential permit. This is a fantastic opportunity to achieve your migration dream. The first option that you can use to go to Spain is a business conference taking place in Madrid in May. The deadline to submit application for this conference is on the 20th of March. On the 25th of March, that is when those that are successful will be announced. All you need to do is to go on the website, which I'm going to show you shortly, and you apply to take part in this conference. The second option is the Spanish Employment Work Permit. The Spanish Employment Work Permit is given to anyone that gets a job offer from a Spanish employer. Once you find a job from a Spanish employer, the employer will then give you an offer of employment to say that you have been offered a job in Spain. You take the offer of employment which you have signed alongside your valid passport, police report, and health insurance to the Spanish embassy. The Spanish embassy is likely to grant you a visa if you are coming to a conference in Spain or you have been offered a job in Spain. Once you paid your 154 euro visa fee, you will be granted a visa which allow you to come to Spain with your family if you have been offered a work permit. That is the second option. The third option is what is known as the Spanish Seasonal Workers Visa. The Spanish Seasonal Workers Visa is given to anyone that gets a job in the hospitality, agriculture or horticulture sector. It allows you to come to Spain and work for nine months. After nine months, as long as you still have a job in Spain, you will be able to renew the visa and remain in Spain. The only difference is that unlike the Spanish work permit, which allow you to take your family to Spain, the seasonal workers route, you will not be able to take your family to Spain until you apply for Spanish work permit, a Spanish resident. And as long as you still have a job, after living and working in Spain for five years, you'll still be able to apply for your Spanish permanent resident and therefore you will be able to bring your family to Spain. These are the three options that you can use to go to Spain. I will show you how you can easily get a job in Spain and I will also show you how you can apply for this fully paid conference in Spain. If you're seeing my face for the first time, my name is Francis. I do videos to show people how to legally migrate to new countries without them needing to spend money on lawyers or agents and therefore save them money. If you're planning to relocate abroad this year and are through student, conference skill worker on skill worker the launch club will give you the information and guide you to achieve your migration dream 
There is no substitute to credible and reliable information and it's therefore in your best interest to consider subscribing to this channel. Follow us on all our social media platforms. Turn on your notification bell on. Share this video with your friends and loved ones. Leave your comment in the comment section and you can encourage me and the team by giving this video a like and make sure you watch this video to the end. I'm going to now show you how to apply for this conference and get a job from outside Spain. If you like what you've heard so far, you've seen value, please consider subscribing to Launch Club and let me now show you how you can easily get a job in Spain. The first way you can move to Spain is through a fully funded uh, uh, conference. This conference is open to citizens from all over the world, okay? Uh, this conference is taking place in Spain on the 9th. It's taking place uh, in May this year, from the 9th to the 12th of May. The, city, the conference is taking place in Madrid Marriott Auditorium. Uh, uh, you, if you are an entrepreneur, you have business idea, you will be able to secure up to 6,000 euros from uh, prospective investors. You will be given invitation letter to attend this conference and you'll be given a certificate of participation, an opportunity to tour the city of Madrid, cultural presentation, opportunity for you to network, this conference is open to anyone from the age of 16 and you do not need English language proficiency test to apply. The deadline to submit your application is on the 20th of March this year and the, the, the attendance will be confirmed by the 25th. Deadline to submit your application is on the 20th of March and the attendance will be confirmed five, five days later. Okay, so how do we apply for this conference? This is what we do. So in order for us to apply for this conference, we we'll go to this page. You can see it's telling you the end date that you must take part in this conference. We click on apply now. Once we click on apply, now it will take us to a page where it will ask us to fill in our details. As you can see, once you fill in your details, it's very, very straightforward. What will happen is it will just tell you to, to, to fill in the details. You fill in your details and you will just put it straight away. Very, very easy to take part in the conference. Okay. As you can see, it will ask you, put your basic information, your name and everything. You fill it there. And once you fill in these details here, once you fill in all your details, all you will just do is take it to the next page and it will ask you to put the submit additional information and you click supply and you click submit make sure you make sure you upload your it will ask you to submit your passport page a uh, professional pictures very very straightforward and you will submit the application it goes straight to the organizers they consider your application and after five days 15 days uh, uh the 25th of march you will know if you are successful to take part in this okay so this is this this is organized by the global business symposium of spain okay that is the first way you can go this one is a fully funded uh, uh conference taking place in spain in may the second way you can move to spain i'm going to show you now the first thing you need to say is that this list here this is the occupation in spain that the government of spain are currently finding it difficult to find people to work on this list, you have uh, solution engineering, cloud system engineering, data engineering, investment banking analyst, system trial, supply chain, expert cyber security, back to back. Uh, uh, even they have social media marketing. Okay. This list is there. They've got sales specialist, accounting executive, growth manager. Let me show you how you can easily get a job in Spain. Okay, so we're going to take one of the lists on this thing. So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to go to this website. This website is, this is called URES. All the European Union uh, countries, they all use this site to advertise jobs. So we're going to type Spain here. Let's type Spain here, for instance. So Spain comes up. So we hit here. If you are looking for job in, the, in any of the EU country, you must have Google Translator. 
So what we're going to do is that because the, most of the EU country, apart from the Republic of Ireland, they do not speak English. So let's see what this job is all about. We click on here. So we go on here. We want to see the, okay, this one is even good. It's in English. We don't need to translate, but you need to have Google Translator. It says here, are you enthusiastic about creating memorable experience? This job is advertised in Spain for non-English speakers. Say, uh, someone that speaks English, they, they are looking for someone that speaks English in Spain. Once you click on this job, assuming you're interested in this job, you want to apply, you just click on here, click here to lead to the, uh, uh, to the application. It will take you and you'll be able to apply for this job straight away. Let me show you another one, how you can apply for another job. It's very, very easy to find a job from in Spain. You just need to know how to go about it. I'm going to show you other ways you can find jobs in Spain from outside Europe. This website is a must and you must have your Google Translator. So let's take another, another occupation that is on this list now. Let me quickly show you. So we're going to go back to our list again. Now we're going to look for a logistic expert, okay? On that list, so, so you go back to this place, you go to this site, you go back to here, what do you do? You just click on here, you click on search, job search. Once you click on job search, you just find, find a job, then you put what you're looking for here, okay? So we're gonna wait for this to load and I will click on Spain again, Spain. Okay. Now what this site is doing, I'm searching for the current job in the field that we've just advertised. We can see there are jobs here in Barcelona. Here, there are jobs here. So these are jobs that have been advertised on this website. Again, this one is not in English. However, with the advance of artificial intelligence, even if the job is not in English, we can usually use Google Translator. All we do is just put it here in less than a second, it will translate it to all. Specialists committed to the addition and promotion of sustainable practice in logistics, guaranteeing a positive environment, imp environmental impact, responsibility. This job is being advertised in Barcelona. Okay, so it's very, very easy. I'm going to show you one more, one more job again. Now, I'm going to show you one more job that, again, how we can find another job. Again, we're going to go back to the list of demand. Let us, this time around, take solution engineer. Okay, so this is, there are other sites that you can also use to get a job in Spain. But this time around, let me just quickly show you this last one before we move on. Okay, so what you need to do is once you get a job in Spain, you are good to go. But I'm showing you now how you can get a job in Spain. So, light. This one again, we're going to go back to this place. We're going to type Spain here. Spain here again, then we'll hit search. Again, it's going to help us search for all the jobs in Spain. Okay, so it's coming up again. This is a system. Uh, uh, this one again is for somebody. Let's see, this one is advertised in English. So as you can see, are you enthusiastic about creating memorable experiences? Then come and join us at the Cantrix workshop and work with energetic people who strive to enjoy every day. Assuming you are in, in, interested in applying for this job again, you go on here, you click on link, you apply for this job, how to apply. That is how easy it is to get a job in Spain. There are three ways you can go to Spain. You need the first option on this video is through a fully funded conference. The second option is for you to get a job in, from outside Spain. Once you get a job from outside Spain, that is what you need to apply for the Spanish D visa. The third option is what is known as the Spanish seasonal option route. The Spanish citizen option is for where you get a job either in, 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 in uh, hospitality, you get a job in agriculture. Once you get a job in any of these jobs, you can come to Spain and work for nine months. As long as you still have a job with the employer, you will be able to renew your visa after nine months. Remember, the cost of applying for Spanish uh, work permit is very, very cheap compared to the UK. 
These are the three routes that I want you to consider. The first one is a fully paid conference where you come to Spain, you attend the conference. The second option is how you can easily get a job from outside Spain. Once you get a job from outside Spain, and that will that is what you need to apply for the Spanish D visa. That is the long-term visa which allows you and your family to move to Spain to take up employment. And the last option is the Spanish seasonal option route so i hope you can take advantage of one of these options if you have seen value for what you've heard and you haven't subscribed to this channel please consider subscribing to this channel and follow us on all our social media platform there is no substitute to credible and reliable information that is the difference between those that achieve their goals and those that do not achieve their goal make sure you turn your notification bell on you can give this video a like to encourage myself and the team for the dedication and the hard work leave your comment in the comment section i will always respond i will leave all the links on the in the description section i will also leave other website that you can use to find job from outside Spain so that you can start finding a job the last thing i want to quickly show you please this is very important do not do anything if you do not apply for any job if you haven't done this this website that i'm showing you now this is called the euro pass this is the website that all the 27 countries that make up the EU, this is the site, this is the site that you can use to create an acceptable CV that they will use. I'm giving you these tools free of charge for you to use it. Use this tool to work on your CV before you start applying for job. You are unlikely to get any response if you haven't worked on your CV. So and this tool, I'm going to leave it in the description section. If you're watching us on our Facebook page, please head to the YouTube channel, scroll down to the description section. That is where you will be able to get this tool so that you can start using it to work. Even if you're not applying for this job, you can always use this to apply for any job within the EU countries. I hope you have found value for this uh, video. Make sure you consider subscribing to Launch Club. Share this video with your friends and family. There are opportunities here for skilled and unskilled workers. May God bless you. May God let your dream come true. I will see you when I release my next video. God bless. Goodbye.